I am a week away from picking up my new car that I ordered 12 months ago. A few years ago, we were on our honeymoon in Japan, and of all the little model cars I collected, I also collected two of my dream vehicles. That is an RX-7 and a Land Cruiser. If there's something I enjoy more than cars, it's getting out there and enjoying nature. And when you combine the two of them together, to me, the possibilities are endless. I recently sold my Toyota Hilux of six years. I love that car. It was a very well sorted, very capable vehicle, but I had my reasons. The main reasons are the lack of usable storage in the tub and canopy setup. I could have sorted it out with a tray and canopy package, but the next reason is because of the Toyota Hilux GVM. Going away with a baby can be hard, especially on the longer trips. You end up bringing more than you need to, but it's also good to be prepared. In the Hilux, the tub and canopy storage was a huge issue. We would literally cram everything into the back of the canopy. And when we travel, we like to travel to a lot of different campsites and it'd be a mission loading and unloading between campsites. The storage issue could have been fixed, like I said, with a tray and canopy package, but that aside, it doesn't solve our issue with the payload. The factory GVM on the Toyota Hilux is approximately 2.8 tons, which means legally at any given time, your vehicle cannot weigh more than 2.8. Aside from the payload issue, I also found the Hilux to be lacking in power, and that is really felt especially when towing. So the Hilux is rated to tow 2.5 tons, but with the boat on the back, which only weighs about one and a half tons, it struggles to hold speed on the motorway. My Hilux was tuned by Mark at Dr. Diesel. He did a fantastic job, but it just wasn't enough. So with all those limitations, in March last year, we decided to pull the pin on a brand new 79 series. Sorry guys, I couldn't get more footage at Toyota, but as you can tell by the look on my face, I am so happy. This 12 month wait has been a really long process. Um, so I'm just happy to have it on my driveway. Oh, she looks so good. Um, yeah, I've got my waterproof jacket on because as you can tell, it is 
pretty much raining pretty heavy and I wouldn't call it bucketing but it is raining and I have so many parts to go in this vehicle just heaps of stuff and I really wanted to get the wheels on today so what I might do is just ride it out in the rain and just get this knocked out Alright, done. I'm soaked and I'm gonna go have a hot water shower, but it looks mint. I'll show you in the next video. See ya.